Formula One coverage on YouTube is presented exclusively by Oricon. fans and welcome back to round two at Interlagos that's right we're here for the Brazilian Grand Prix my name is Victor Simons and I'm here with my co-host Markiplier AIR he's not actually an AI but he is a mark and that's just not okay I remember all my regrets <laughs> uh, sorry mark I, I I've been having horrible allergies ever since we came to Brazil uh, th there must be some kind of tree that's pollinating around here that's fucking with me <coughs> uh -oh. oh my god, I'm doomed! <laughs> oh, 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 all right, we're both having allergy attacks. We'll, we'll be right back after the qualifying highlights, with, which we've shortened for viewer retention. Yay! <laughs> god help me, please. Feels a lot more loose today than it did yesterday. Uh, that concerns me. Just a Tad. That's what's constantly making uh, Rosetta Stone angry during my German lessons. Be honest. Oh my god! If I don't do this right, I'm going to get hit. I'm an F1 driver, we abuse track limits all the time! You'll be starting 20 seconds from the grid. That's your best lap so far. <sighs> you know what, I'm least I'm on the grid. Jesus Christ, okay. I think I got my hopes up too much in Australia, Jesus. Oh my god. Would you believe it, the dumbasses at Liberty Media forgot to give us the qualifying standing, so we'll just give a little season recap, I guess. Uh... Well, they gave us eight cars out of 22. That That's still not good enough. I'm still pissed about that. I thought that. they said Don't AB wrong. Cars. Wait. But, yeah, that's the thing that's happening. You shut up for a second. Also, uh, should be known that Turo... What? Uh, went into the pits three times. That's embarrassing. Twice in a row, even. That's even more embarrassing. But I'm gonna laugh if you guys laughed. Give us the correct information, please! I'm just kidding. Alright, here we go. Season recap. So, so far, e Turo is... I know you're kidding, but you're gonna get us fired. Are you fucking kidding me? No, get... There we go, yes. e Turo is leading the championship, followed by M. Hackenden and D. Coulter. They're... With only six drivers having points so far, right now Minardi and McLaren are neck and neck for the championship. Anyway, let's get into the race. Five, four, three, two, one! Woo! Turn off! Brazilian Grand Prix! Here we go, straight well, into last, so the action! Long. Can't lose positions based on my start. Turo is currently in what I like to call the dead last club, a very shameful club to be in. However, everyone is getting away from me. This is more what I expected when joining this team. 
Here we have shenanigans going into Pin Hero. Don't know if that's pronouncing correctly, but yeah. Oh my god. Has spun and hit his ass to go with the death. Mark, are we sure that this is the same man who just won the Australian Grand Prix last week? Yup! Well, you know what, Mark? I admire your enthusiasm. I'm amazed that I didn't take damage from doing that bullshit. Okay, I have straight line advantage, straight line advantage, let's go. Making up positions here. That's some tension Arthur action going into the seat of the soil and Oh, there has been a bet there between the Minority Ford and the Arrows. Yeah, I already explained but all, it looks like neither cars have been damaged by that collision. That's another side hits. Alright, back hanging out with the boys, maybe. I can drive properly. I can't really drive, if I'm being honest. The arrows is acting funny. I'm acting funny as well. Looks like Turo was aiming for 16 as we go around the corner and oh, Yoros Verstappen is trying to force him off the track on the inside. That, that, that has to be a dirty move. Surely the FIA has got to do something about that shit. Or the stewards who are in charge damaged my goddamn suspension. Doesn't work out that way. Hmm. And that's just not okay. Not very, but he did. It's fine. I am losing a little straight line speed though. That felt goofy. No problem, these other guys are going plenty fast. I'm not incurring a penalty for that. Okay, get out of the car. Let's go. I'm not Damon Hilling myself. That sounds like a euphemism for suicide, actually, now that I think about it. No, I didn't spin myself. That's a raindrop. I'm wearing a helmet. How would I spin on myself? There's no chance of rain, technically, it's just <laughs> probably a little bit left from yesterday. Thankfully, there's zero chance of rain today.
Nagaki, three seconds ahead. Foot is two seconds behind you. Scar's ability to take corners like that flat out is incredible. Don't abuse the grass here, it's not well cut like it is in Albert Park. What are you doing here? Surprise, motherfucker! Oh, don't be a dick to me, man. Burst is just ahead. Burst staff is two seconds behind you. is trying to kill me. I know! Oh my god. <laughs> I can, uh, <laughs> turn, I was going really fast for the elf like it always run past the cog a little bit, but he's made a great effort to slow down after that, so he's not gonna get penalized like Damon Hill did back at Albert Park. And he's spun out again. Good pass again! Christ! I guess I am, because he just passed me. Okay, dicks. How is he going that fast? That's your best lap. Nagaki, 
Takagi is just ahead. Is it just me or should does Takagi have DRS on his car? I don't think DRS is legal. Not legal, but invented yet. Fucking Jones. Ralph, two seconds ahead. The guy is only a second behind. with Ralph Schumacher. Whoa, 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 whoa. Did the so Minardi and the Jordan's the wheels so just Victor? clip through each other? Mark, let's see that. Okay. Okay, so Ralph Schumacher made a pretty good pass on E2. It looked a little we later, weird, as you can see here. Let's go slow-mo replay on that. And, yeah, there's something else about that. Wouldn't you agree? I didn't realize this. Uh, I'll be right back. Can you hold on? Yeah, there's a... This is a trick. Got it. Sorry, sorry, uh... Um, My um, god! I'm just wrong. Don't know why that is. What just happened?! Sorry, I had to kill a spider. I, I don't know what just happened, man. I'm clueless. Seems like a nice guy so far. Ralph, just ahead. Thought we were supposed to get joined by Martin Brundle, though. But he was supposed to do the announcer. Or the commentating, as they say. Whoa! There's a yellow flag ahead. Slow down. Don't pass. Ah, damn it. Verstappen, only a second ahead. You win this one, Verstappen. Well, seconds behind you. Okay, you're out of the car. Let's go. And he dropped out of the race. Oh, what happened? Is Penny's okay? Her staff is only a second ahead. Or do you get black flags? Four seconds behind you. You are pulling away. I'm trying to figure out what would happen to him to cause him to get black flags. Did he use a spare car or something? Isn't that what the spare car is fucking for? Oh, 
rapids, only a second ahead. Busy tail is four seconds behind you. One thing I do love about the Minority 4 gun driving is that, you know, I haven't really had any big failure problems with it. Like, uh, my first ever race in 10 cars failed. This was not one of them. Busy Jell is five seconds behind you. You're going away! Collision force in the reverse! Oh. Just like what Irvine did to me, what the hell? Can he do that? Well, can he do that? Obviously, he already did it. Is he allowed to do that? Just ahead. Not anymore! Hey Nakano, we stole the vacuum system from Stewart today, so if you want to try it out. Oh cool, let me see. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, oh. hey Tiro! Hey. 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 Sorry, friendly wheel bump. Oh, let's not do that. Uh, excuse me, coming in on your uh, inside. Yeah, I'll oh, pass you on the screen. Oh no! I may have fucked up. Oh fuck! Oh, 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 okay. Oh, there's another one! Is the counter okay? Uh. Can I get a stats update? On the counter, please? Please? Maybe? Yeah, but is the counter okay? Shit. <sighs> That's no good. Still two seconds ahead. First stop is four seconds behind you. I remember that guy. That's the guy who passed me accidentally during the yellow flag. Oh well. The 
yellow flag ahead. Yeah, whatever. My engine angry. Alright, for a seven, we've activated your spy hunter gear. Get ready to defend yourself against Tora. Alright, ready? Ready? He's getting really close. Activate oil slick! Whoa! The seven wants to play games! I don't like these games! But it's not like people wanting me to play in Monopoly where I can just say no. I have to play this game because it's my job. You're pulling away. Absolutely amazing pass from Turo. Gets right past Verstappen and immediately is able to block him before Verstappen can do anything to retaliate. And just dominates through that corner and Verstappen kind of left. Alright, Nakano, great to see ya. I really enjoy those moments. Bye bye. Kill the meat problem there. That's my question. Hill, only a second ahead. The cannon's two seconds behind you. I saw someone smoking cars. <laughs> oh, but uh, Turo is saying so, is a car is down. What? You? Why do you sit down? Sit down. Why do I sit down? And he's dead. You think that's funny? I'm gonna laugh if you guys laughed, but not in a ha ha way, in a ha ha you're sad way. You sick fuck. What is wrong with you? Get out of the car. Let's go. Looks like a all-white car, so I assume it's one of the uh, Stuart Fords. It's Bear Keller again. Body Keller, out. Fourteen cars left. Yep. Fort is Two 
You're in main position now. Ah, oh, boy. That was a collision I did not want to have. Simon's having been rushed to hospital due to falling and hitting his head. We will be taking commentary of Formula One. Who? Imbecile, when you're listening, we're the Techno Union! Okay. Uh, like, what are you? We supply technology to the separatist movements. When you sit down. But the Techno Union is perfectly comfortable standing up. You know, a lot of you are standing up right now, you need to sit why must we sit down? The Techno Union is going down! Come back for it again! I dare you to do it! You would never come back! I can pass it. Before the yellow flag. Yellow flags at this corner are devastating! Yeesh! Bob's? Bob's what? I just noticed that sponsor. What's Bob selling? Merchandising? It's on a radio show. I feel like he's selling refrigerators. I don't know why I get that notion, but I feel like Bob is selling refrigerators. Mia. Oh my luck! My luck is good! That happened right after I spun out. It'd be incredibly embarrassing if that yellow flag was for me, but... At the same time, it'd also be funny. Okay, get out of the car. Let's go. First is five seconds behind you. Hey Mark, sorry about that, I'm back. Uh... <coughs> Uh, hey, who's the guy on the ground? I have child tomato. Oh yeah, that's uh, that's a, that's a really dumb fake name. To, who? What idiot in their right mind let in a man whose name tag, whose identification says child tomatoes? Statistics are out the window. <laughs> and so is our new friend. Uh, well, that was odd. Well, I suppose the responsible thing is to go and call security.
I think I have a chance to make it into the points. Okay. Alright, Irvine, Irvine, Irvine. I do not like Irvine because he no clips through my ass in the first ever race I competed in, so... This is not great first impr- That was an easy battle for six. Yo, Turo did not just blow past me. A shot, but they're not real yet, man. They're not real yet. Oh, shit. In my opinion, Irvine was the big roadblock. So, with Irvine out of the way, our chances are skyrocketing exponentially and no way is that a salver or am i losing my mind is that benetton My hair keeps dripping down from my goddamn helmet and getting on my nose inside the fucking ball cloth. But ain't that something? I suppose they call it a head sock. They only call it a ball cloth in tanks, if I recall correctly. And I have never been in a tank. Or do they? You know what? I'm gonna look that up. The internet's young, but I'm sure it's useful. Because I'm I'm not bothering myself going to a library after a fucking race. They invented the internet for a reason. I like it so far. Rapid. That was good. This is good. We have a chance. We are back super close to Elise. Oh my god, it is one of the Red Bull Sobbers. And they're, and they're gonna call them Pat the Patronus Sobbers. It's Red Bull that's on the car, not Patronus. If he covers yourself with the Red Bull sponsorships, you're the Red Bull car. Only four laps to go. Oh, I'm terrified. I just robbed the Ulisi of points! 
Oh my god! Maybe Australia was not a fluke. Ah, uh, welcome Schumacher. I'm best Schumacher. I'm in third. My only enemy now is the McLarens. The McLarens terrify me because they're the fastest fucking cars on the grid. I like the Red Bulls in 2023 and four. I'm catching up to these bastards in two laps. There's not a chance in hell. Okay, maybe there's a chance in hell, because I can see him. So far, but the end it didn't even matter. Oh my god. Go for it. Hackenden, four seconds ahead. Juma could two seconds back. Four down. Oh my god, this is insane. Alright, maybe I'll flag my action, allow me to cheese. Okay. Slow down, they had to do. And it means nothing. Alright. And David Coulthard takes it home! Closely followed by his teammate Hagenen and Turo trailing along in third. Go at 20 seconds to third. That's a run if I ever seen one. You're on the podium. Let's go everyone! I came from 20 seconds and now I'm here! Hey, this one actually looks like a trophy this time. God, my hands are about to cramp. Well, damn, was that a good race. The McLaren's pretty much dominated the whole time. That was kind of boring. But we did see some interesting action out on the rest of the field. First of all, Turo just proved that Minardi might actually have something going for it this year by getting on the podium a second time 
in only the second race of the season. This is a backmarker team, and they've done this. On top of that, the Stuart Ford, while showing that it's not a very reliable car so far, seems to have a lot of tech that the other cars don't have, even if they aren't really able to get in the higher field. And on top of that, you have Hakkinen, Irvine, Damon Hill, Verstappen, and even Turo proving themselves to be incredibly aggressive drivers that are putting on really good shows so far this season. Statistics are out the window. I just want to point that out. It's the companies that are wrong. It's simple logic. You are absolutely right, Mark. As commentators for Formula 1, we kind of have to admit it's a little bit elitist. So seeing things like this happening on the grid, you don't get this a lot, and it's really exciting. Last week, in all honesty, we were kind of destroying the system. You know, we, we were... Well, I'm Victor Simons, commentator for Formula 1. And yet, my name is Mark Blyer. Bye-bye! Formula One coverage on YouTube is presented exclusively by Oricon. Alright, stay tuned to Fux, because in just an hour's time, we're going to be having live coverage of the Trigger Room concert at the Ford Event Center. It's going to be happening at 7 p.m. Central Time. That's 7 p.m. for Houston, Chicago. Not for a certain other cities, but that is where it's going to take place. It's gonna have a lot of lasers, a lot of spotlights, a lot of people, a lot of energy. And you remember, at the Ford Events Center, you can still get some last minute tickets at this moment. It's not fully sold out quite yet, so you do have some time to go do that. Now, I actually don't know why this current footage is from an iPhone. I, I'm not gonna ask the higher ups here. The studio does some weird stuff, I can't always explain that. Now we here at Fox News would like to remind you to wear earplugs during this event. Concerts, rock concerts are very loud, they're definitely loud enough to cause permanent hearing loss or permanent hearing damage at the very least. So do be safe out there, don't drink too much because I know they do serve beer at that concert. And I hope you will enjoy it. One hour's time, the Trinity Concert. Stay tuned to Fox News.